today we're taking a look around this Sea Dream Yacht Club ship. This is Sea Dream 2. There's also a Sea Dream 1. They're exactly the same, each carrying just 112 guests. We're going to start at the top deck and work our way down and I'll show you everything that Sea Dream has to offer. So let's start at the front of deck 6 where you have this sunbathing area complete with really comfortable sun lounges and each one has a towel on it. There's also this couples jacuzzi there's a warm one and a cool one it's a great place to relax also on deck six we have the clubhouse with a golf simulator for those who like to practice golf while they're on a cruise and then round here we've got some comfortable seating areas and we're going to make our way back towards the aft of the ship here we have the outdoor restaurant, which also doubles as a bar. This is called the Top of the Yacht, and it's a great place to come and have a drink at any time of the day or evening. Now along the side of the top deck, we have these Balinese beds. These are fantastic for sunbathing, but you can also sleep out here at night if you want to. They will be made up as real beds with duvets. This is a fantastic spot to sit right at the back of the top deck. You can watch the sail away from up here and get the very best views over the aft of the ship. There's also binoculars as well, so you can look out for any wildlife that you might spot. Heading downstairs now into the main section of the outside dining area. So this is where you'll always have your breakfast and lunch. And should the weather permit, which it does on most days, you can have your dinner here as well. Breakfast and lunch is served buffet style, but there's also a la carte options available. And then the evening meal is served as a five course dining experience. You can choose to eat by yourself, you can just sit with some friends that you've met previously, or you can just be asked to sit with new people and uh, make friends with them then. Now heading towards the back of the ship, you'll find there's more seating areas here. So there really is a great variety of places to sit and there's actually enough seats for every single guest to dine outdoors at the same time. This is probably one of the best ones here because you've got this lovely view over the aft of the ship. Heading down to deck four now, along this corridor of cabins, we will get to the spa where you'll find a fully equipped gym. There's treadmills, there's cardio equipment, and there's also a decent section of weights as well. So you don't need to miss your workout. One of my favorite things about this gym is this fridge where you can get ice cold towels. Also here we've got a very small casino. This is open every evening for those who'd like to um, spend some money in there. And we also have this beautiful library. There are so many books here. There's also a couple of computers. The internet is free to use in the library, so you don't necessarily need to buy the Wi-Fi package. This is a lovely place to just relax and spend some quiet time with a book. Here as well, we have the piano bar. So there will be live music here every evening. You can have a sit at the bar or around the piano, or you can just head up here first thing in the morning and grab yourself a nice cup of coffee and take it back to your room. Now let's head downstairs to deck three. And here is the bike store. So you can borrow bicycles and take them ashore in most of the ports. Heading indoors now, um, we have the main reception area. So this is also a shop, so you can get your Sea Dream merchandise here. You can book your excursions, you can book your future cruises and anything that you need help with, just head to the concierge. There is never a queue and they're always super happy to help you. Heading indoors now to the lounge. This is another fantastic space. There's enough seats for every single person on the cruise to sit here and gather together. There's also a bar, but the waiters come around so often that you never really need to uh, get up and go there. And then just outside, there's another small area where we've got lots of different board games that you can borrow. And this is a lovely, quiet little spot to relax as well. Look at these fresh flowers. Yes, they are real as well. Now let's head outside to the pool area. The pool is a decent size given that this is such a small yacht and the sun loungers are super comfy. We've never ever had a problem with getting a sun lounger. There are enough for everyone. And this is just a brilliant place to relax during the day and take a dip in the pool. There's also a jacuzzi, which is lovely and warm 
However, one of my favourite things on this deck is the slide. Yes, that's right, Sea Dream Yachts do have a water slide that will take you all the way down into the sea. This is fantastic. You should definitely, definitely do it on your Sea Dream cruise. And then also at the back of the ship, if you go through this gate when it's open, you can head down to the marine platform where you can take part in all kinds of water sports. There's kayaks, jet skis, banana boats, snorkeling, you name it, you can do that off the back of the ship. Now let's head back indoors. We're going to go back through the main lounge and downstairs to the lowest passenger deck, which is deck two. And this is where you'll find the main dining room. There is also an indoor dining room. It's not used too much, mostly just if it's a bit cold or windy outside, then dinner will be served in here as well. But this is a lovely space. And it's also got enough space for every single guest to eat together. I do hope you've enjoyed this tour of Sea Dream 2. Sea Dream 1 is exactly the same. The ships are twins. So if you're planning a cruise on this luxury yacht, then I'm excited for you because you really do have something special to look forward to. If you enjoyed this video, then I recommend that you check out this video next. I was lucky enough to spend a whole week on board Sea Dream 2 and I have a vlog that shows exactly what we got up to. So watch this one next if you want to see more.